In today's video, I'm going to be breaking down the counter to one of the best running plays in Madden 21. Yesterday, or I think it was actually earlier today, we talked about the wide zone run, and we're going to talk today about a counter that you can utilize that really goes hand in hand with that run. Now, if you've never been to my channel before, my name is Cody, and basically what I do here is I upload four videos every single day that are designed to give you a tactical Madden 21 tip strategy tactic or uh, game plan and so if you're looking to get better at the game one of the best things you can do is click that subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen all right guys so in the video prior to this we just talked about wide zone and what i want to do for just a moment is talk about the counter to wide zone and that is the 26 duo at least that's the way that i'm going to work it in this scheme you could also use inside zone weekend we'll talk about that in a little bit but uh, what we're going to primarily focus on right now is we are going to focus in right here on the 26 duo run now first and foremost i want to show you wide zone and we're just going to go against some random defense now wide zone this is why i like the run so much it's one of the hardest runs that i've ever seen in madden maybe in madden history um especially in real life it's one of the hardest runs to shoot meaning that the the, the gaps the gap integrity of the run is just really, really effective. And it was made famous, I think, by Mike Shanahan, Terrell Davis, and Coach Gibbs as well uh, over at Denver. And then the Kyle Shanahan's kind of brought it back with the 49ers and has made it just as effective and really turned Raheem Mostert into a top-level back. And in my opinion, what a lot of people would say is one of the better backs in Madden uh, this year. So the counter to it. So with wide zone, basically what it is, is it's an outside run play. Now, again, you it's not exactly just an outside run play, as you can see right there. But it's a, it's a run play that is designed, the offensive line really is designed to kind of get down and get on that plane and get that almost, it's not a stretch, but it's similar to a stretch. The duo play is designed to do very uh, is designed to do something completely different. So you see here um, those wide steps, those wide steps of the quarterback, those wide steps of the lineman. The duo is a little bit different. Duo is a little bit more of an interior inside middle lane running play, as you can see right there. And again, I think duo and wide zone when you combine the two of those. They are very hard to shoot, meaning the defense can't really shoot these runs. You know, they're going to have to shed to stop this. And with the way that Madden works, what you're going to see is a lot of people are going to start basically trying to stop the, the wide zone. And what that's going to do is it's going to open up this duo run because the duo run really works well um, when they start to spread out their line of scrimmage. Maybe even they start bringing safeties in the box. As you see right here, he's going to bring safeties in the box and we're going to be able to run the ball right up the middle. So, you know, this this counter, this 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 little, um, basically this little chess match that you're going to play is the duo run is really going to become much, much more wide open when they start blitzing a lot of people and when they start trying to really over over um, overshoot the wide zone. So duo is a really good run. It does have a stretch, or uh, I'm sorry, a slant route attached to it. So if they're if they're blitzing you heavy or they're not pass coming in or they're not paying attention, you can still hit this uh you can still hit this little slant route in behind it. I almost wish the slant wasn't there as you see there. If they're in a zone over there they're gonna be able to stop it. But I almost wish that the slant wasn't attached to this because then we could flip it back and forth and we could run it both sides. But you know this is a very good run in and of itself the inside zone is not um is not the same as duo as you can see here it do it, it duo is almost like a it, it's like in my opinion the way i imagine it is duo is like the power run games version of the 01 trap meaning it's it's kind of one of those uh, run plays that's going to take advantage of the over pursuit of the defense. So if you if you're starting to feel like eh, there's really starting to slow down my wide zone, my bread and butter, I would encourage you to try to run duo. Most of the time, duo is going to pop. Now with duo, there's one other thing I did. I haven't talked about this real quick. I want to hit it, um, but basically you can cut it. You can cut it. You can cut it back against the grain. So you can take it um, down the middle. Of course, you can also you can take it outside to the right. But you can also, um, as you see here, I can take it to that side on the right side. But you can also take it uh, back across the uh, across the play. So, like right in here, 
I can cut it to the left. Now, it's not necessarily the greatest idea to do that, but you can do that if they over pursue. I'm just wanting you to know that you can do this little double juke right here and you can get to the left side. Most of the time that's not gonna be open if they have good gap integrity, but if they're just over pursuing you, you know, you can do those jukes, those cuts. Those cuts are available to you. So I just want you to know kind of what all is in your arsenal. So when you get the ball in the snap split second decision, you can make an adjustment. You can make a quick, quick uh, jump cut into a lane and know where you can basically, you know, what are the what are the what are the options that you have as the offensive player. So the duo is really, really good. I like wide zone as the base and I like to use duo off of wide zone. But these two running plays, in my opinion, these are probably the two best runs. When you put them together, um, the only thing this playbook is missing, in my opinion, is I'd like to see them have um, a true traditional stretch and a true traditional maybe like trap or power uh, type of running play. But as you see here, duo, you get that nice cut block on that left side guy, which makes it just so, so effective. But... Anyways, guys, uh, our CFM is starting up tomorrow. It starts up. It's on PlayStation 4. There are cash prizes for the winner. There is a buy-in fee uh, for that. But, again, if you win, you will get cash. But, basically, what I want you to do is if you want more information about the CFM, you can jump in the Discord and throw it in there, But the which will be great. But the best way to do that is to just text me. My number's in the description. It's also in the top left corner of every video that I do. It's 812-216-3644. So be sure to shoot me a text. Let me know if you want to be in our PS4 League. We do draft, and the draft is tomorrow night at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. So I just want to make sure uh, we get everybody in the league before the draft starts if you're interested. And this is for cash money. So, uh, you know, it's very serious, very committed players. There's some really, really good people uh, in this league. So I just encourage you, if you really want to be a part of something, uh, we'd love to have you join the league. But that's 26 Duo. We just wanted to share it with you. And uh, shoot me a text. Let me know about the league. There is... Um, there is the Discord as well if you have questions or if you want to learn from other people in our community. That's a great way to do it. Uh, join that. You can get new lab partners out of it. You can uh, ask questions that not only I will see it, but everybody in our community will see it. So a lot of good stuff. Make sure you're subscribed. We do have uh, another video coming tonight, and we will also be live streaming on YouTube, Twitch, and Facebook at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Links to all of those uh, channels are in the description of this video. Thank you.